Hey guys, it's Gypsy Soul, and it has been way too long since my last video. Um, but I wanted to hop on here real quick and do this video. Um, because this is something that um, I have been doing, and um, it's been, I can't say it's been working, but it's, I don't know it feels like it feels right so I'm gonna share this little witchy tip with you okay so this is my current um, book of shadows uh, art journal slash doodly do book um, and it has, the weather has been just complete crap here. And when I say that, um, I mean because it has been raining literally every day. And so I was collecting all these bottles and containers of this rainwater and charging them under the moon. And I was like, I have got a ton of it. I'm like hoarding it up. What, you know, I need to use it for something. So, um, Crystal Dragonfly has infected me with the, um, art bug, the, um, artsy fartsy bug. And I've been doing, you know, a lot of little art things. And it, popped into my head um, because I was thinning some paint out and I was using water and I was you know I was like well why don't I use my charged water and see what happens so this is what I came up with okay I'm gonna put you to the page in here I had showed this page this page is just something you know I kind of did um like a mixed media kind of page and I hope the light's not too bright for y'all actually a little bit of sun but don't worry it will go away and more clouds will come um this is a little I don't know a little saying that I came across on um Pinterest but I changed up some of the words, changed it up a little bit to make it relevant for me. And as you can see, it looks like a preschooler wrote this. And that is because I am not an artist by no means. Um, and I totally am trying to get the feel for paintbrushes. I use this little tiny paintbrush here. And don't even look at my nails. I like ripped them all off. But um, just this little you know fine little paintbrush and I'm using just um, cheap acrylic paint from Walmart and I used my charged water and I thin it out and then I you know like I said I'm not an artist but I wrote this out using my charged water and if you pause it and read this, um, it's saying, it's, you know, saying, well, heck, I'll read it for you. One day I will be an old woman with long silver hair, magical tattoos, eyes full of light and love, and lots of laugh wrinkles. My children's children will lay out with me under the stars by a campfire on a river bank. We will listen to the waves and make music. I will tell them my stories of wild adventures, of conquered fears, lived dreams, and a full life lived. They will be inspired by my words and my love to seek out magical journeys of their own. As above, so below, so mote it be, I make it so, blessed be. I, I did this like a spell, and um, it is what I would like to happen, that truly i'm trying to manifest this this would be something that you know i would this is how i want it to be 
this is how I want it to be. And, you know, I could think of no better way than to use my charged water to put, you know, some intention, more intention. You're already putting intention into this when you do it. The act of doing it puts intention into it. And when I added my charged water to thin out the paint to do it, that just added, you know, added more to it. So my point about to this whole video is you don't have to be an artist, you know. You, you don't have to be like able to do calligraphy or, or paint a portrait or, you know, anything spectacular like that. Put some of yourself into it. Just something as simple as this can become magical and it becomes magical because you make it so and I just wanted to share that with y'all hopefully I'll be doing some more videos because I've been doing a lot of this and there's a few more things I'd like to share with y'all so I'll talk to you chickadees later bless be guys bye <laughs>